Sports are really a big part of my life. They already took me from a big depression that I had uh, before. I think I'm just alive because I really started exercising. And that also brings me the drive to develop myself in many ways. My name is Gabriel. I'm a technical people manager at Waze. I'm from Brazil. Uh, I was born in the city of Porto Alegre and I came to the Netherlands with my wife in 2018. I started working at uh, Ward Zilla in 2020. There they produce engines for big ships, so the ones that really carry the containers. Those engines, uh, they cannot stop because imagine that a ship stops in the middle of the sea. That's a lot of money that's going to be lost. And because of that, they add sensors to those uh, big, big engines that they have. And they use the data from those sensors to give maintenance uh, to those engines before any problem happens. And what I did there was to create applications that would help them to visualize this data and see when it was necessary to do this maintenance uh, to make sure that the engines would not stop at the mid of sea. After my time at Wardzilla, I did a big change in my career. I decided to go to a more people-related area and now I'm a technical people manager at Waze. I think this decision was based on two things. The first is that I always like to help people since I was a kid. And also that my interests start to changing a bit. Instead of studying technology, I start studying more about society, people, and also soft development. And I decided to make this transition to a more people-oriented career instead of being just a developer. Uh, one of the th uh, most important things for my job is really to develop the people at Waze. So what I usually do is try to help them as much as possible, just by setting goals or find materials to them to study. I also go ahead and look for courses. In any way that I can, I help them to achieve their goals and really to achieve something in their lives. I really like to see them striving and in a better position than before. Uh, I think I learned by going to the gym and trying to achieve uh, every day better. I think that just really translated to my life. Uh, it really changed the way I see stuff and in my life. I, I think this really moved me to a new level that I would not be right now if I didn't start it. And nowadays I continue doing, I, I'm not doing it a lot. At CrossFit, one of the things is the mental challenge that you have because you need to do something that you usually you are not really into doing that because it's, uh, it's related with pain and a lot of effort um, in one time and you really need to do that. And I think this really translates to my personal life and really my work life uh, that I really just try to do as much as I can even if after that I'm going to be lying on the ground and all sweaty. One of the things that I can say for sure is that I see myself uh, in the Netherlands in the next five years. I'm really grateful for uh, everything that happened here. My idea is really to become a citizen. Uh, I'm working on my language skills right now to improve and be able to really be fully integrated here. I think these three years and a half that I'm here, uh, it really showed me uh, how good is the country, how good it is to live here. Me and my wife were very welcome anywhere that we go. Yeah, and I'm really grateful for ways. Uh, what, what can I say? Yeah, we came from Brazil. You guys gave all the support. Uh, I developed myself a lot in the company as well. And I see the support that you guys give for all the consultants. That's really amazing. I cannot put it in a better way that, yeah, I'm really happy to be here. And I hope to be here for a long time as well.